Hi Foundry family. I'm not your speaker Brad Formsma from this week and I'm not Eric Folkers but I do have your first question for discussion groups. Can you describe a time when someone was generous to you with either their money or their possessions? So this text, this passage comes to us out of the book of Galatians. The book of Galatians was a letter Paul wrote to the church of Galatia. And in this, he, he addresses the divisions in the church. Uh, there was backbiting and fighting. There was um, people who had even grown weary of doing good. And the apostle Paul addresses these divisions and um, understands that the people come from different backgrounds, from Jewish and pagan backgrounds and things like this, and understood how to you know, keep tradition differently. So the question that I think is best asked out of this is, uh, is said this way. How can common divisions keep us from doing the good we were intended to do? Can you think of a time when someone's generosity caused you to give glory to God? Which form of generosity, whether it's sharing stuff, words, thoughts, actions, money, attention, or influence, comes the easiest for you? Okay, your final question is coming from Passion City Church here in Atlanta, Georgia, where we are at a worship conference this weekend. And here's your last question. So Brad has spoken about three lessons no i don't know what it was sorry <laughs> brad has spoken about three life lessons of generosity he has learned the first was awareness what opportunities are you aware of around you and i totally forgot what mine was <laughs> but if she gives me the phone i'm gonna read it because it's hard to do camera and that yeah. um try to think of three specific areas people um areas or people you could be generous to and describe how you can be generous with that. We hope you had a wonderful week of worship. We look forward to being back with you. We missed you. Missed you. <laughs>